What is up, everybody? How y'all doing? Good to have all you here. Why am I hearing an... Am I hearing an echo? Am I crazy? Those are two very different questions. And yet they lead to the same... Inevitable conclusion! Here on tonight's episode of... The GCTV Random Cast. <laughs> What's up, everybody? How you doing? Why is this thing, like, so far away? I don't even understand. Why am I orange? What's going on with this thing tonight? I'm moving this over. All right. Hello, everybody. What's going on? Welcome to the GCTV Random Cast. I'm your host, my sister, my name is Dark Side Rob. It is good to see all of you here. I understand why there's an echo now. It's because I'm wearing these headphones that I don't normally usually wear. And I can hear myself talking to myself, talking to myself, speaking to myself, talking to myself. Welcome to the show. Welcome to the late night cast. I have an excuse. I do have an excuse. I came with a letter for the teacher because of my absence. It's good to see all of you. Welcome to the official Friday Night Random Cast. I'm going to be playing some Yakuza Zero tonight on the cast, and I have a reason for that as well. So first things first, um, I needed to record a Rob observation today because work's been fucking crazy. I was going to try to record it yesterday, but this one was inevitable and it's time sensitive because it has to do with stuff that's going to be going down on Monday. And if I don't get it out this weekend, then it's going to be a observation that doesn't have any purpose to it. So I was recording that tonight and I had a lot of work this week and I just like eight o'clock start time did not. It came around and then it went and I was still working on YouTube videos. So I had to make a decision and I was like, well, I can do this now and get it done. Start the cast a little bit later than usual, or, or I can finish this stuff now, start a little bit later and do that. So I decided to do that so that I could get some stuff done and get you guys some new content as soon as possible. So that's what I want to do. I want to get you guys more cool content as often as I can. Uh, in the meantime, I want to thank everybody. We, we hit for, for momentarily, <laughs> momentarily, we hit 2,400 followers. I hope that through the course of this evening's festivities, we'll pull that number back up to 2,400. But let me just say right off the bat, you guys are fucking amazing. Thank you so much for following. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting this channel and the YouTube channel as you guys always do. I can't thank you guys enough. It's, it's just awesome. And it, I love having you guys here and I love doing this stuff for you. And, uh. I'm trying to do more of it and as much of it as I can, in addition to all the other things that I'm trying to do. Um, well, there were a couple of things I wanted to talk about tonight. So yeah, so new. Hey, what's up, Muffin? How you doing, man? So there's new. There's a new observation coming. There's a whole bunch of videos that just went up on the YouTube, including a observation that I put up earlier in the week. I think it went up on Wednesday. So that was episode eight. There's a channel update that also went up. There's some playthrough videos and I was considering doing a series of um, this game as a YouTube video series let it die for those of you who can't see it I have been meaning to play this game and I haven't gotten around to it and I mentioned today to people in the discord by the way if you're not following or participating in the discord channel you should definitely go check out the discord channel uh, because that's where I talk to you guys about stuff you want to see on all the networks here and everything but I was talking to some people about doing this as a YouTube series see how high up the tower I can get uh, because I haven't really had time to cast it so that could be something that's happening in the near future uh, but I wanted to play some Yakuza and for those of you who know that I've been super hyped about Neo um, Neo is going to be played on this cast soon one of the reasons I'm not playing it right now is because everybody and their sister is playing it on Twitch so it's just like a little bit of overload right now on how many people are playing this game uh that's the first part and then the second part is that hyper how are you dear it's good to see you happy weekend um the other part is that i want to just i want to set it at a time when i can just focus on nio neo whatever and right now i'm like my head is down and focused on finishing yakuza or at least getting as far through it as i can before i go done with that I just don't want to be bouncing back and forth between 20 games and unless I absolutely have to. So I'm just going to hold off on Neo for a bit. We'll do some Yakuza. We'll have some fun with that. And then we'll see where we go with what game we play next. And I mean, shit, by the time I start uh, dumping timing in, into Neo, 
my other and most anticipated game of the year um horizon zero dawn is going to be out so it's like you know fuck me man like the beginning of this year is just like loaded and ready for bear like it's just fucking there's so much stuff coming out right now it's insane then the other thing i wanted to mention real quick was um pax east is coming up i am going but i'm trying to figure out what my bent what my my focus on it is going to be because there's certain limitations on what i can do this year and, and you know um <clears throat> i'm just trying to decide what would be the best focus of my time my attention my camera my interview mic and i really think this year what i would love to focus on is really just focus on the indie mega booth as as a thing so <clears throat> right now the plan is to go to be there to go to the indie mega booth and the indie mini booth and talk to as many indie developers as i can because that's really one of the best parts for me of uh, more so than ever the last couple of packs has just been like yeah i hear there are a couple of big developers here but i really want to see like what the one two five person teams or you know ten or let ten or fewer people uh what they're doing and and get get people from that group uh because it's just awesome what those guys and gals are doing every year it's like it's awesome it's one of my favorite parts of the show so i'll give you guys more details about what's going on with that soon i have a couple of new ideas for youtube shows that i want to do um one of the cool ones that I have an idea for is called Video Games in Real Life. Uh, I'm not going to give you uh, exact details on what that's going to be because I'm actually going to talk to my friend and a, a fellow camera guy on Sunday about how to do that and how to make that interesting. And if we have enough content to make like more than two episodes out of and if we want to spread it to bigger things. But I mean, you know, I have all of New York City and then the Northeast as my backyard, pretty much. So there's a lot of video game in real life stuff to be had and seen and filmed. And that could make for a very interesting YouTube series, I think, to sort of expand the scope of what we're doing on the Game Crashers channel, as well as a couple of other ideas that I have in mind that I haven't quite figured out what they are yet. Troll, I, you don't have a choice. I hate to break it to you, but you don't. Are we dropping frames? Why are we dropping frames? We've been dropping 205 frames already. Ya big dumb jerk. <laughs> That's great. <clears throat> also, I think my screens are different. Uh, I, think, I feel like my camera is less orange. Orange, you glad I didn't, whatever. Garrett, what's up, man? How you doing? Garrett, it's been a while. Good to see you. Welcome in. It's just a forest. Um, there was one other thing, and I don't remember what it was. So yeah, so new, uh, new observation episode coming tomorrow. So there's that. Were you were you around when I said that in BB stream? I might have missed it because I was actually there was a period when I was in BB stream where I muted everything so that I could record the Rob Observation episode. So I really needed to do that. And then the other thing, oh, that was it. There was, I wanna do some more gear and tech and audio and video uh, videos, I guess. Like I wanna do stuff about the setup that I'm using, some of the gear that I own, some of the music gear that I own. I definitely wanna do some stuff like pull some music gear together and show like what gear I find interesting and you know, sort of that that's more game crashers stuff from the music bent that i'm trying to get to but you know that's sort of the next thing after video games in real life and more press any key episodes and more stuff going to the um the website which by the way i wanted to mention again if you guys aren't following on twitter and on facebook and on the discord and all of the other social media places please 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 Take a look at the links down below and click on all of them and join all of them, especially the Discord and especially Twitter, because it's really important that I have a, you have a direct line to me and I can get in touch with you guys and we can talk about what's going on in this channel. Again, also YouTube, got a whole new collection of videos. Please comment, please, you know, say say and, and do stuff there and check and like out at like out. What the hell word am I saying? Like and subscribe to the stuff there and please comment on stuff because I was just, 
got a great comment on one of the videos today that I ended up responding to. And, you know, we all know how the internet can be sometimes with comments, you know, <laughs> comments on YouTube are like assholes. Everybody's got one. Uh, but the truth is, is that I do appreciate that stuff. It means a lot. Having the community aspect of this thing working is really fun and I really enjoy it. And then, um, yeah, so pretty much everything that I do in one way or another is going to end up on the Game Crasher site. So if you guys want to see an update of everything that's going on in one place, GameCrashers.net. I have neglected that site for way too long. And I really, 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 really want to put more stuff into that um, website. That includes the music stuff that I'm right, the music stuff that I'm working on, any interviews that I'm doing, any videos that I'm recording, any uh, YouTube uh, press any key or collection videos, or anything like that. I'm gonna try to put all of that stuff in one place and have that be GameCrashers.net. So definitely check that out. And then last but not least, music casts. I can't believe I forgot about music casts. We're gonna have more music casts. I promise you, we're gonna have more music casts. I'm gonna try to stick to three casts a week. And it's either gonna be two music, one video game, or one music and two video game. But this week was just a bad one. I did not get in the other two shows that I wanted to do, but I'm gonna try to do three casts this upcoming week and just keep on keeping on. Um, yeah, so I hope you guys will take the journey with me. In the meantime, why don't we get into some Yakuza? I don't think there's anything else that I can think of that needs to be mentioned, but I will say, like, Discord, Twitter, YouTube, Facebook, Steam, Steam page, GameCrashers.net. Find, connect on all of those sites that we have because it's awesome to be able to connect with you guys and find out what you guys like, what you guys have thoughts on, what you guys have questions about, and what you guys are sort of, maybe it's working, it's not working. It's the best way for me to, to be able to tweak what I'm working on so that it's everybody's getting something out of it. Uh, to help with Twitter, you can call me using the phone number you have. Oh, I don't know where that number is anymore. I threw my phone halfway across the room earlier today because, well, not, I threw it into the couch. Where did it go? Oh, it's over here. Because I found out, like, I, I was tweaking my setup because I'm still trying to excise a stupid buzzing sound from my setup. And I think I figured out what it is. But I'm using this Astro A30, A40 mix amp. Uh, and unlike the other gear in my setup, which is already sensitive to uh, cell phone signals, this thing is just, like, sucking them up like a... And just, there's just nothing worse than that noise of a cell phone being picked up by, uh, other electronic audio gear. And I, and this is something that happens all the time. It drives me mad. I don't know why people turn off your phones when you're using audio equipment or put your phone on the other side of the room because those signals can get picked up by audio gear. And every time I hear it in something that's technically a professional recording, I want to eat my hat. Ah, anyway. Anyway. Just saying. Be professional, people. Try more, harder, better, faster, stronger. Anyway, let's get on with it. What do you guys say? I say let's do. Let's make it happen. And as always, cheers.